What would you do if I told you that you could change the world? That you alone could shape it to make it whatever you felt? What would you do if you knew that you could lead the way directly? That you could be the change? And that I could prove it? If you let me. They say it's impossible for just one person to change the world. But everyone in the world is just one person themselves. So if every one person in the world decided to change themselves, then everyone in the world would change. And then, of course, we change the world. To rebalance their wardrobe, to include more secondhand, and that's because we're trying to encourage people to use the resources that we already have. We don't believe that you can consume and conserve, mm -hmm. and this, as a clothes reuse charity, this is our way of um, promoting the idea of secondhand and enlarging the market for secondhand and um, encouraging people to value their clothes more and to value the resources that they already have rather than buying new. Buying new stuff, okay. Yeah. And um, who do you target? Everybody, trade, the trade customer, mm -hmm. there isn't a typical trade customer. It's mothers and professionals and students and people who are into fashion, but people who are just buying for work. So we're targeting everybody. But I would say that within our education work, although we work with people of all ages, we focus some of our work on young people because there are certain fixed ideas about secondhand being negative mm -hmm. and we work to try to combat that. And part of the partnership with Potent Whisper has been about targeting a new audience and um, promoting the idea that anyone can go secondhand and that it isn't a negative thing to do and that in fact it's incredibly positive. Very good. And um, who do you, who you, what do you aim to achieve? I think ultimately we would like people to buy more secondhand and less new. Okay. And um, how was trade born? So the charity launched in 1999, mm -hmm. and yeah, we so um, our one of our, our purpose is to stop unwanted clothes from being thrown away. Mm -hmm. So we collect clothes and we reuse them. We sell them in our charity shops, mm -hmm. and then with the funds that we raise, we come full circle because we support international development projects. Okay, that's, good. that's all about improving the fashion industry. Mm -hmm. So all of our funding which is normally about half a million pounds a year, mm -hmm. is committed to projects. For example, um, stopping child labour, mm -hmm. okay. um, uh, supporting farmers to stop using pesticides when they're growing cotton. Um, so so it's, there's, there's a lovely link between how we raise our money, mm -hmm. which is also in, an environmental, and, and the beneficiaries mm -hmm. of our funding. And then how long has it been running? Um, the trade has been running since, since 1999. 1999. Yeah. So how, how long is this made? So secondhand first been, week, yeah. this is only our second year. Okay. Yeah. And, um, and it's really great because it feels like the values of trade mm -hmm. have come together in a, in a, a, a mixture between a philosophy and an action mm -hmm. because part of the whole idea of secondhand first is that it's a practical and s it's a practical way of immediately adopting a more sustainable way of life you're immediately not consuming as much mm -hmm. and we believe that overconsumption is killing the planet yeah. and it can't continue yeah, definitely. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. can i just um and this is all the questions do you want to add anything no, I think that's fine. Oh, oh, I know. Well, yeah, yeah one yeah. thing. Um, so uh, a very easy way that people can participate mm -hmm. all around the world. They don't have to be in the UK or in London. Um, they could take Trade's Secondhand First Pledge, which is online. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. And that's www.trade, T-R-A-I-D, .org.uk. 
go onto the website, you'll see Take the Pledge. Mm -hmm. And what we ask you to do is to commit a percentage of your wardrobe sourcing it second hand. Mm -hmm. So that could be borrowing, it could be charity shops, it could be vintage. Um, and that's a very easy but, but very impactful way to participate. Fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you.